can't have my child today Cancer what? Cancer who? You can't have my child today Just because I love him to the max I go hard today, I go hard tomorrow I don't care what these haters say Cancer what? Cancer who? You can't have my child today Cancer what? Cancer who? You can't have my child today Just because I love him to the max I go hard today, I go hard tomorrow I don't care what these haters say What's wrong with you? Hi everybody, um, so I'm going to pretty much talk a little bit about how I felt um, hearing that we were coming home. Um, it was actually like such a really good relief um, being there for so long and just not knowing when the day is going to come that you're going to, um, you know, get out of the hospital. Um, I started feeling like I guess towards the end, I started feeling a little bit more um, like anxious just because I knew the day was coming, but when was the day coming? So I think that's like, I, I feel like people might think it's a little bit easier once it gets towards the end, but it actually does not get easier. Um, if anything, it's probably a little bit harder because you're like anticipating, you know, the day that you're going to actually go home. So I was hoping to go home like two days prior to that but it didn't happen and it was just really discouraging um i had a really rough time the last few days in there um it was really emotional for me um but actually hearing that we were going home on th that thursday the 14th day which was two weeks which was his shortest round ever um i felt such a relief um because that day i was going to the retreat and i didn't want to like go to the retreat and like be worrying about him or when he was going to go home and I also wanted to actually walk my baby out you know of the hospital being that we were there so long I wanted to be there and just enjoy the excitement with my husband and just like celebrate you know as we were leaving and stuff so um everything is always in God's timing and in his hands um yeah I did say I was getting a little antsy to leave but I do believe that the reason why we went home that Thursday is for a reason, um, being that I was going to the retreat. Good morning, everybody. Yesterday, last night, yo, I had a crazy encounter with God, yo. Like, I mean, like no other. Like, I gave him every single bit of my energy, yo. I asked him, like, I, I just want to give him everything. Like, I don't care what every single thing like, take it and do what you will with it, man. Like, do whatever you need to do with it because I'm tired of fighting by myself. You know what I'm saying? Like, like I, I'm just tired. I, I don't want to do it by myself. Like, I need him in my life every single day. You know, no matter what, no matter what, I need you. Like, I can't, like, keep going like this or whatever by myself because it's so, so much. And, yo, man, we've been, we've been, like, working and working and working and working and working to be you know out of here to make sure christian is great to make sure christian is good yo every single day like praying and this morning i wake up and my son is completely cured you know what i'm saying like we out of here yo we going home we going home yo i'm so hyped yo we going home baby like like yo man I, I don't I don't even be cursing like that or whatever too much on, on here. But yo, cancer, we whooped your ass, yo. We went in, we went in, yo. Like the positivity, the outpour, yo, the love, yo. Uh, yo, I'm just so grateful for God, yo. He really like I gave him every 
ounce of me, yo. Y'all don't understand, man. Y'all don't understand. Like, every single ounce, I, I gave it to him, yo. I gave it. And now, now we get to go home, yo. My wife gets to go on her retreat, you know what I'm saying, in peace, peace of mind, you know what I'm saying. It's going to be me and the kids this weekend. We're going to have a ball. We're going to celebrate. We're going to celebrate with y'all, yo. Like, it's on, man. It's on. Next level, you know what I'm saying? Next season is here. We, like, I am so excited, yo. My son is cured and defeated this, man. You know what I'm saying? 19 months. 19 months. My son only 19 months old, yo, and, 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 and went in like a, like, like a true champ. Like a real champ, yo. Like a real champ. Like, y'all don't understand the passion and the love that I got right now because my son defeated this, yo. Defeated this. We're going to celebrate. We're celebrating all day. We're celebrating all day. All day, yo. All day. Look, man, if you wasn't in this position, you probably wouldn't know how I feel, yo. You probably wouldn't know how I feel right now if you was never in this position before, yo. But we're celebrating all day. So tag whoever you got to tag. Say it to whoever you guys say. But you make sure you give God everything, everything, and he's going to do it for you, yo. Give him every single ounce of you, yo. Nothing short. Don't hold back nothing, yo. And, and don't care, don't give a damn what anybody got to say, yo. Don't care what anybody got to say because that's between you and your God, yo. You and your God, yo. You and your God, yo. Nothing, yo. You go out and you do what you got to do for you. Because at the end of the day, yo, it's only you and him. You know what I'm saying? Take care of your family. Take care of your work. Take care of, the, you know, uh, 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 the things that you got to take care of and give yourself to him and everyone else. Only in the way that he wants you to give it. Only in the way that he wants you to give it, yo. I love y'all. We're going to celebrate. I got a video dropping today, especially for this moment, yo. I love it. Low life is music. Like Failure is a chapter we can never write. Lost and drunk in vision of a better life. Engraved inside a heart that you can never break. Success is just a park, I'm not the heaven's gate I'm just trying to live this life, I'm trying to take control of My thoughts, my time, my grind, I shine like I'm a supernova About to blow up, so I roll up, take me someplace solo Music's my drug, I'm buzzing, you're trying to make me sober Hating, faking, making statements, do I even know ya? Fresh fusion taking over, just know that You can never push your dreams too far That's why we never be back at my house and I can sleep in my own comfortable mattress bed <laughs> and I I don't have to have a to use a duffel bag for only a small amount of a clothes of clothes and I basically get I have I get to have my friends over and I get to play in my big backyard and um, I'm happy that my grandma actually gave us a place to stay even because if she wasn't there I wouldn't have a place to stay during these five rounds of chemo and I'm happy that my brother doesn't have any cancer no more and that he survived these rounds that he's been through and that my mom and my dad have just been going through this and not giving up the whole way through and I'm just happy that I get to be in my own house again so I just got home and I was trying to change the water for the fish for my kids. And the fish jumped down the sink. <sighs> Y'all, I feel so bad right now. I feel so bad right now. Like, <sighs> like I gotta go buy another fish.
Y'all, I feel so bad right now. I feel so bad right now. Like, like I gotta go buy another fish. Like, they named the fish and everything. Like, they didn't really know what to name the fish anyway. They kept going back and forth on the names. But they gonna wake up and they gonna see the fish gone. It's a horrible dad moment right now. Good thing Christmas is around the corner. Let's just give him another fish. But maybe I don't really notice. I'm going to just buy my new fish tomorrow. Maybe they don't notice when they wake up in the morning. Caleb might because he's super nosy and observant. Nana probably won't. Hmm. Okay, so the good news is, is the kids didn't see that the fish is down the drain. All right? So now it's Operation Dad cover it up before they get home from school and they got a new fish. The hard part is going to be finding the same exact fish. Alright, here we go. Petco. We're about to find out. Alright, y'all. Let's hope they got it. I think this is it. This dude right here. Hmm. Sean, I want to pick up the phone. She called me. Yeah, she don't want to pick up the phone. He just called me. I got the fish back. It was the only one there, too. The only one that looked like our fish. So, uh, hopefully they can't tell the difference. I ain't going to say nothing if y'all don't say nothing. See, my kids ain't got no social media. <laughs> So I can put it up, and they ain't gonna know. But anybody that go to their school, y'all better not be saying nothing, yo. Look at this dude. Hey. Hey. See, the only thing is that he changed some colors a little bit. Well, I could just tell them that. Listen up. This is gonna be our little secret. You come into our home, you don't say nothing, I don't say nothing. Alright, if they start calling you a certain name, just nod your head and say, yeah, what's up? Cool? Alright. Josie at home right now, getting the uh, the, the fish bowl ready. Okay, she's so cleaning it out. <laughs> Man, they're going to look back at this one day and be like... Like, I know it's a different fish and I know it got red in it, but here's the thing. We could be like, yo, that joint changed colors, yo. You better tell them kids the truth. No, they can just know, like, you know, it just changed colors. You're really not gonna tell them the truth. Nope. There he is. I don't know, y'all. I think he looked the same. It's not the same. Well, they ain't gonna know the difference. Yes, they will. Unless you tell them. I'm gonna tell them. Why? What'd you say, Caleb? The color. Where? Right here, it says boost color. Oh, okay. And so, what did you say? The color, the color of the beta fish, instead of being purple, it turned to blue, and now it's red. <gasps> you think it was the fish food we gave him? Yeah, because it said blue color. Now he's red. Look. Oh, wow. <laughs> no, 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 move it. Okay, or you can just bring it to me. First he was purple, then he was blue, and now he's red. You see? Yeah. He doesn't like that. Oh, okay. So you think his fish food made him change colors? Yeah. Interesting. It has, it has, it has dried up curl and shrimp. Makes it, like, look different. Oh my god, why is she red? Uh.
Why do you think he changed colors? It's a different fish. Y'all killed Jehovah. Nuh-uh. Calm down. Y'all cut him. I know you did not cut him. What's happening? What's happening with what? Why are you recording me? I'm recording Jay. <laughs> With my fish. Nothing. <laughs> Y'all got a different fish. This isn't Jehovah. I don't want this. That fish. is Jehovah. Where's Jehovah? <laughs> no. We ate it. We ate it. My fish don't sit there like that. You flushed him down the sink and you got another fish. So why are you recruiting me? I have a headache. I don't have time for We put him in here and we made him a drink. <laughs> what? And we ate him. Did you buy me a dog? Back home, I think the kids figured it out. Josie was sending me pictures and uh, and videos earlier, so I don't know. I think I think Caleb knows it just changed colors by itself. He says something weird or whatever because of the food or whatever. It could change color. So that's what he going to believe. That's what we going to stick with. But Nana, I don't know. Nana might be, she on to us. She on to us. She called me during class talking about something that happened to her fish. I hung up on her. She talking about? For not telling me what happened to my fish. Because I know something happened to my fish and I'm not stupid. Jesus is telling me that something happened to my fish. Now. Oh, Jesus told you? Well, guess what? The fish jumped down the drain. <laughs> I ain't cut nothing. Is that why he's red? No. Mommy, you did it? What are you talking about? He jumped. He was out. He left. Wait, so whose fish is that? It's your no, fish. That's not my fish. Yes, Where it is. is that I'm going to kill that. You ain't killing nothing. That's not my fish. That's my fish. Well, ain't nobody tell you your fish to be leaping like a frog. So where'd y'all get that fish from? Pecco. Hey! You got him from the same same spot that the other fish came from. So it's the same fish. They come from the same home. It ain't fake. It's alive. Why would you do that? You lied? What? You lied? Lied about what? You lied? Lied about what? That's, that's not the one that you got from no. No, the one I got from baby shower jumped out the bowl down the drain. It jumped as I was trying to change the water. Baby power? Baby power. Huh? That one, the one that you got from the baby shower was like almost purple. Like it was all purple. Now this one is blue and red. Well, you know what? Blue and red equals purple. <laughs> <laughs> hey, look. Y'all got another fish, and this time y'all got to take care of the fish, because y'all wasn't taking care of the fish anyway. I was changing the water of the fish and feeding the fish. I was feeding the fish, too. I was feeding the fish. When you guys, it's, it's supposed to be fed two times every day. Well, you got a new fish.